This is Zach with Cyclocross Magazine. I have Cornet Van Kessel here, our second place finisher at World Cup Waterloo. Some good teamwork from Telnet Fidea today in that chase group, huh? Yeah, it was great to, to be with Dan in, uh, in the first uh, chasing group and uh, we, we uh, split, up, uh, split up the work and uh, to take the second and third place, it was uh, fantastic. Do you race a lot of road? Uh, we did uh, 25 uh, road races, I think, uh, this, this summer, so it was a good, uh, good program. So you're well prepared yeah, to work we, with a teammate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we do a great summer. So going into the you know last time at Trek Factory Hill, what was your plan? You know to try to put yourself in the right position. Uh, yeah, you know it's hard to to to, to chase the wheel uh, after the tr the factory wall, but when you run ahead, you can make a mistake and 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 hold the, the lead, and then it's not so far to the finish. So I want to be there first and. Uh, was was lucky that it uh, it was right what I did and uh, I can take the second place. So were you the first one up the hill? Yeah. In the last climb, yeah, and then yeah. first into the last corner. Yeah. So you kind of did everything right. Yeah, <laughs> it's good. Uh, the plan works, so I'm happy. How did you end up in that chase group? What? How did you you know end up a, in that chase group before? I had a good start, and uh, Mathieu uh, attacked uh, directly. And uh, I was there behind uh, Lars in the start. He, he crashed Im immediately in the first corner. And uh, the second lap, uh, Quinton Hermans they did just the same. So I can always pass them on the inside. And, and yeah, we had a gap behind us. And, and I was looking, uh, Wout wasn't there, uh, Tone wasn't there, uh, all, the, all the other riders, they, they were behind. So yeah, we, we, sh we shared the work with Dan and uh, yeah, we, uh, we finished the second and third. Were you at all concerned that there was you know, there was a lot of firepower behind you? You know, yeah, Tone yeah, was there yeah. and uh, Tone and Wout they they, uh, they attacked us from behind, and uh, we have to to keep the the speed high to 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 hold them back. But uh, yeah, happy that that it works. And then finally, one last question: You guys have been shuffling, you know, the Telnet riders. Seems like your teamwork has been great. Does this give you a lot of confidence heading back into the European season to have such a great result? Yeah, of course. It's it's uh, it's good for your self uh, uh, confidence, and uh, yeah, it's great to to move with this result back home. And are you looking forward to to getting back home? Yeah, of course. It's yeah, been a long two weeks uh, here, but uh, yeah. The American guys, they, they come uh, two or three times a year to Europe, so we don't have to, to, to yell, and yell about it. Yeah, and top thing that you liked about America? Uh, yeah, great place to be here, of, of course, at Trek. And, uh, but yeah, it's, it's uh, less stressful than in Europe to start the season. Mm -hmm. Well, cool. Well, Courtney, congratulations on your second place finish. And here in the U.S., we'll be watching you on a live stream. Uh, but thanks for coming to visit us here in America and have a great, great trip home. Thank you.